Greetings everybody, this is Sweet Beats. Just taking a quick look uh, specifically at the direct out functions on my Studer 928 mixing console. Uh, in my last video I went over the detailed functions of the mono and stereo input uh, modules. But I kind of glossed over this N minus one, it's a mix minus function for the direct out jacks. Now folks that are in broadcast engineering probably know exactly what that's all about. Uh, it's a bit unfamiliar to me and the manual is a little dubious how it's written. So I plug stuff in tonight and messed around with it and I think I understand how it works. Um, the direct out, the balanced direct out jacks on the mono input modules on my console can either output the um, pre-fade or post-fade uh, input signal, whatever the input source is, whether it's the mic or the line input. The direct out jack can also um, be sourced to the aux one bus. So now any this anything assigned here does not go to the aux one master down in the master section but instead goes to the direct out jack on this module. There is also this mix minus function. Um, that in essence is like for the anchorman to be able to get a mix that does not include him or her, or the, the anchor person. So when I do this, now the direct out jack is going to be a sum of any input modules that have this function pressed. So now let's say we have a mic here and a line input here and another line input here this is now going to output at the direct out jack the sum of these but not this one it's a mix minus it's a sum mix of all the other n1 assigned inputs minus its own source and so that would mean the direct out jack on this one is going to be the sum of these three it's a mix minus this one and in kind this direct out jack now is going to output the sum of one two and four minus number three and so on the other thing that it can do is it can um, output a sum of the master a bus so any modules assigned to the master A bus, now this direct out jack is going to output a sum of any modules assigned to the master A bus. Those, you know, if this is a microphone, a microphone, microphone, line, line, this mix minus direct out jack uh, engaged function. What's going to be output from here is this mic, this mic, this mic, this line source, this line source, but not this one. Even though this one is assigned to the master A bus because it's a mix minus. Um, again, I'm still not exactly sure how I might use this in a studio setting but there's probably some wacky way that I could use it. It just basically allows any direct out jack to be a sum of any other channels that you assign minus the source on that strip or to grab any strips that are assigned to the master A bus, those sources minus that strip. So that's what the mix minus function is. And then, as I mentioned in uh, my other video, um, the direct out jack can also directly output the talkback mic just to that direct out jack. 
and also output uh, the tone generator, whatever, um, whatever frequency tone is selected over in the master section. So lots of things you can do with the direct out jack on the Studer 928.